and Temple University now looking for a new leader. President Jason Wingard has res resigned, that is, after less than two years on the job. Wakisha Bailey stopped by the campus earlier this morning to get the students' reactions. Temple University students say that they were not surprised with the president's resignation given so many safety issues that they've had on campus. Jason Wangard, Temple University's first black president and the school's 12th president's resignation will be effective Friday, March 31st. Wangard's tenure was filled with scrutiny regarding crime around campus, the death of Temple Police Sergeant Christopher Fitzgerald, a 42-day strike by graduate student workers, and a week ago the faculty union authorized a vote of no confidence against Temple's leadership. And the interim Temple's board of directors will designate a small group of senior Temple leaders to guide the university. And many students say Wangard was more concerned with his personal image over safety after failing to move into his on-campus housing as promised last December. We've been getting emails from him where he's trying to make it seem like he's like doing more than he actually is and like weirdly like victimizing himself. It's one of the only campuses in America where I feel like it's normalized for my classmates to constantly be targeted and uh, facing violence on a daily basis. In a statement, Temple's Faculty Association says, quote, while President Wangard's resignation is a step in the right direction, his departure does little to address the structural issues and governance at Temple University. And many students that we spoke with say that they hope that this is the beginning of many changes. Lakeisha Bailey, CBS News, Philadelphia.